Hi everyone, welcome back to this current affairs series for the upcoming NABAD exam. My name is Pooja Rawat. All right, and we've already done or completed our current affairs till the 26th of August, but still few people were complaining and they were asking to extend it for another week. So uh, I'm trying to cover it till 5th of September uh, in today's session. All right, and I hope iske baad koi problem nahi hone chahiye. So you don't have to worry and you're not going to get any question after uh, this, all right? So just cover it till today and you'll be good to go. So let us begin. Before I start, all those people who are here for the first time, do subscribe to our channel and press this bell icon so that uh, you don't miss on the latest updates. And you can also join our telegram group wherein you can post your queries and you'll be updated with the upcoming videos. So let us begin our session. This is the first question and it says, which of the following state has recently launched Atma Nirbha Krishi Yojana and Atma Nirbha Bhagwani Yojana? So these two schemes are recently being launched and as the name suggests, this Atma Nirbha Krishi Yojana is in the uh, field of agriculture. While this Atmanirbha Bhagwani Yojana is for horticulture sector. Alright. And the correct answer here is Arunachal Pradesh. So Arunachal Pradesh has recently launched these two schemes which are a part of Atmanirbha Bharat package uh, which was being uh, launched by the central government. Alright. So we'll study about these schemes in a uh, bit detail. So... These two schemes were launched and both of these schemes are part of Atma Nirbhar uh, program that was announced by central government during the budget session in 2021, alright? Now under this scheme, Thoba kya is scheme, provide kya jayega? Kya kya jayega? Now the credit link will be provided to the beneficiaries by the SBI of Arunachal Pradesh Rural Bank and the Arunachal Pradesh Cooperative Apex uh, Bank. Sorry. So these bank will provide credit support. Sorry. These banks are going to uh, provide credit support to the uh, farmers, all right. And under this scheme, forty-five percent of the uh, loan will be provided as the government subsidy, and another forty-five percent will be provided as the bank loan. Okay, so forty-five percent of the government subsidy, okay, that means the government is going to pay for that, and forty-five percent would be given as a loan, while only ten percent will have to be contributed by the farmer itself. Right, so ratio of this 45 is to 45 is to 10. So 45 by government, 45 as a loan, and 10 percent would be won by as uh, by the farmer itself. Now to avail this scheme, no land documents such as land possession certificate will be required for self-help groups. So this may the loan over that can be extended to individual farmers as well as to the self-help groups, which are a collective of the farmers. Right, so for the self-help groups, there is no requirement of any land document, all right, and there will also be no collateral requirement with respect to individual schemes to get loan up to 1.6 lakh. Okay, so if an individual farmer is applying for a loan for about 1.6 lakh, then he or she uh, does not have to uh, give any collateral for that loan, all right. Similarly, for self-help groups, no collateral will be required for loan up to 10 lakh. So 10 lakh the loan loan over that will be entirely collateral free. So these are the credit support uh, scheme which will be given to the farmers in the agriculture and the horticulture sector. All right. And the ratio would be 45, 45 is to 10. Second question is India's first Dugong Conservation Reserve is going to be set up in which place? Park Bay, Gulf of Mannar, Odisha Coast or Kerala Coast. So Dugong jo hai, aapka ek marine mammal hai. So this is a mammal. Okay, marine mammal hai. Aur iska jo habitat hai, it's near the coast. Coastal area mein normally aapko jo Dugong hai, wo dekhne ko milega. Because of seagrass. This food hai main wo kya hai? Seagrass hai. So, jo aapko coastal areas mein hi milti hai. And that's why dugong jo hai wo coastal areas mein hi dekhne ko milta hai. Now, India's first 
कंजर्वेशन रिजर्व इज गोइंग टू बी सेटअप इन दार्क बे ठीक है सो पार्क बे विच इज इन साउथ ईस्ट ऑफ यू तमिलनाडु दिस इज इन तमिलनाडु तो यहाँ पे आपका पार्क बे है ठीक है दिस दिस एरिया सो यहाँ आपका ये कंजर्वेशन रिजर्व जो है इट्स गोइंग टू बी सेटअप Now the next question is which of the following statement is true with respect to recently launched plastic pact on September 3 2021 so this uh, plastic pact has recently launched okay and first statement yahan pe hai india has become the first asian country to launch such pact so this one is correct so this india plastic uh, pact is uh, one such pact which has been launched by an asian country all right so this uh, mm, I would say this plastic pact, or this initiative, is being supported by the UK and uh, United Kingdom. Uh, all right, and India is the first Asian country to participate or to uh, develop such pact. Second statement is Indian plastic pact has launched as a collaboration between the WWF India, which is your worldwide fund for nature, India, and the कॉन्फेडरेशन ऑफ इंडियन इंडस्ट्री तो सी आई आई एंड डब्ल्यू डब्ल्यू एफ इंडिया के बीच में ये कोलेबोरेशन किया गया है सो अलॉट ऑफ इंडस्ट्रीज पार्टनर्स आर बिंग पार्टिसिपेटेड और राइट सो उन लोगों ने पार्टिसिपेट किया एंड दे हैव कमिटेड फॉर द रिसाइकलिंग ऑफ द प्लास्टिक दे हैव बिन यूजिंग इन दी पैकेजिंग और राइट सो बोथ ऑफ दीज स्टेटमेंट आर करेक्ट सी वुड बी द राइट आंसर है ना दिस इंडियन प्लास्टिक पार्ट हैज टारगेट्स Which is to be achieved by 2030. Okay, so 2030, the 2030 तक कुछ targets हैं that need to be achieved under this pact. So जितने भी industry partners हैं जिन लोगों ने भी ये pact जो है वो sign किया है, they will be going to implement these targets or they will they will be going to achieve these targets by implementing a few initiatives. All right. तो फर्स्ट है डिफाइन अ लिस्ट ऑफ अननेसेसरी और प्रॉब्लमेटिक प्लास्टिक पैकेजिंग ठीक है सो उनको एक लिस्ट बनानी होगी जिसमें वो सारे पैकेजिंग जो वो लोग यूज कर रहे हैं प्लास्टिक पैकेजिंग यूज कर रहे हैं और अननेसेसरी है जिसकी वजह से एनवायरमेंटल पोल्यूशन हो रहा है उन सभी की क्या होगी एक लिस्ट जो है वो क्रिएट करनी पड़ेगी एंड एंड आइटम्स एंड टेक मेजर्स टू अड्रेस दम थ्रू रीडिजाइन एंड इनोवेशन ठीक है सो दे हैव टू Uh, go for redesigning or innovation in the plastic packaging so that the environmental pollution can be reduced now the second target is 100% of the plastic packaging to be reusable or recyclable so 100% jitni bhi plastic packaging ke liye use ki ja rahi hai us sabhi ko recyclable banana hai theek hai it should be recyclable or reusable now second another target is 50% of the plastic packaging to be effectively recycled so 100% recyclable honi chahiye and at least 50% ko aapko recycle karna hai all right ho sakta hai ki aap aapne maan lijiye 100 bags hai plastic ke aur all these are recyclable inko recycle kiya ja sakta hai but at least 50% jo hai yani jo 50 bag plastic bags hai unko recycle karna hi karna hai Then the next target is twenty five percent of the average recycled content across all plastic packaging. यानि कि nationwide जितनी भी plastic packaging use हो रही है उसमें से twenty five percent जो होने चाहिए that should be recycled plastic. All right? जो कि freshly prepared नहीं है बस जो आप plastic use कर रहे हैं उसी को आप recycle कर रहे हैं उसी को आप reuse कर रहे हैं तो twenty five percent should be recycled uh, content. All right? so these are the targets which needs to be achieved by 2030 under the indian plastic pact now the next question is which e-commerce partner has recently launched or or recently announced the launch of kisan store so kisan store basically kya hoga ek online platform jaise ki hamare amazon myntra flipkart hai to isme aapko ek kisan store create kiya jayega jahan aap farm implements yani ki farming se related जितनी भी रिक्वायरमेंट है वो न्यूट्रिशन हो सकता है सीड्स हो सकते हैं डिफरेंट फार्म इम्प्लीमेंट्स हो सकते हैं और इन सभी को क्या किया किया जाएगा लिस्ट डाउन किया जाएगा एंड फार्मर्स कैन डायरेक्टली परचेज फ्रॉम दिस किसान स्टोर और सो ऑप्शन है यहाँ पे अमेजॉन इंडिया मिंत्रा फ्लिपकार्ट नाइका द करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज एमेजॉन इंडिया सो अमेजॉन इंडिया हैज लॉन्च दिस किसान स्टोर इन 
हिज प्लेटफॉर्म तो जहाँ के जो फार्मर्स हैं दे कैन बाय द फार्म इम्प्लीमेंट्स एज वेल एज द सीड्स एंड न्यूट्रिशन एंड अल अदर रिक्वायरमेंट फॉर देर फील्ड The last question for today's session is: Which state has recently launched the Rural Enterprise Acceleration Program called SAAT for self-help group women? So recently, uh, this state has launched this Rural Enterprises Acceleration Program. So name se pata chala hoga ki rural enterprise ko accelerate karna hai, scale up karna hai, right? And this is going to support self-help group women. So is program ke under SAAT program ke under. जो सेल्फ हेल्प ग्रुप है उनको आइडेंटिफाई किया जाएगा विमेन सेल्फ हेल्प ग्रुप एंड दे विल बी गिवन ट्रेनिंग एंड स्किलिंग सो जो भी वो रूरल uh, एंटरप्राइजेस uh, को सपोर्ट कर रहे हैं फॉर एग्जांपल अ वुमेन इज वर्किंग इन एक समथिंग क्राफ्ट के सेक्टर में काम कर रही है ठीक है तो उसको क्या किया जाएगा बेसिकली स्किल किया जाएगा उनको ट्रेनिंग दी जाएगी मिनटोरशिप मिनटोरिंग uh, की जाएगी सो दैट जो उनका बिजनेस है उसको स्केल अप कर पाए दे केन अर्न मोर एंड मोर प्रॉफिट right so this is the something that is uh, going to be happen under this program under this sat program and this program is being launched by jammu and kashmir this is basically to uh, make women self reliant and to make them financially independent so that they can support themselves and their family all right so this is this program so this was all about today's session and uh, with this we are done with the current affairs All right, and I hope अब इसके बाद किसी को कोई परेशानी नहीं होनी चाहिए and we have covered, I think we have covered more than enough uh, which is required for your exam. So just uh, go through all the current of your sessions which has been uh, done previously and revise them and you'll be good to go as far as the agriculture current of your section is concerned. All right. So I'll see you in the next session. We'll continue with the ARD static revision series. and will come up with a more such questions and um, yeah i'll see you in the next session till then keep working hard keep studying